All right, as the sun is going down, so is my energy. I will say this is from the legal perspective, who I would recommend and who I would not recommend. Uh-oh, I don't recommend any of these. I forgot to bring out the ones that I do recommend. All right, I'll add those later. So, uh, Heidi Meeks, Meek, sorry, she's not Meek. She works as a pro bono coordinator. Well, I'll tell you what, all I can say is that I don't think she likes her work. And I think that it is expressed in her treatment of those who would like to get it. Okay, Lee Goddard, attorney for Donald Carano, Carano, McDonald Carano. She, uh, I don't think she's figured out yet that it doesn't matter how successful she is in her career. If the Caranos are done with her, she will be discarded. Can you imagine that? Eric Stovall, he was the one that uh, I used to sing with at Summit Christian Church. Well, he, oops, there's goobers on there. He's the one who uh, now works with Summit Christian Church. And when I happened to mention that Summit Christian Church, I caught their leader in a lie, he didn't care. This is one of the hardest ones, the marriage of Jim and Susan Proctor. Jim Proctor, CPA, I met him at Sparks Christian Fellowship. Decent man, decent man. Long story, but he married um, Susan. I played for their wedding. He paid me. Well, guess what? He shares an office with Eric Stovall. What I see going on here is when a person is confronted with somebody's sin, which the Bible says we are supposed to deal with, they run and hide. It's just, it's too hard to confront people on, let's say, lies, the lies of Steve Bond at Summit Christian Church. It's too hard, so they pretend like it doesn't exist. Do you think they're going to get away with that? No, they won't.